Hey there, I'm a person and I'm sitting here, and today I would like to talk about Solana NFTs. I had the opportunity to learn more about the entire space because if you think about NFTs right now, you can buy them on OpenSea and pay insane gas fees for ETH, like $60 to $100 just to make a single transaction. There are Cardano NFTs on CNFT, there are Altura NFTs, and as you've probably heard in the last couple of weeks, there are also Solana NFTs. So I thought it would be helpful to take a look at Solana NFTs and how the entire process of minting, creating a wallet, all of that is supposed to be. It is far easier than a expected and there are some major upsides I think when you try to mint an NFT on Solana compared to like OpenSea for example. Also there's going to be a giveaway later on in this video so for that stay tuned. Right now on a site like Solana Art for example you can already connect your wallet which is either the Solid.io wallet or the extension Phantom or Soulflare. I personally use Phantom but it doesn't matter what you use just any of those wallets. When you get the extension for that installed you have your wallet after you save your recovery phrase and your password the usual stuff and then you can deposit Solana. Recently Solana spiked at over $200. Obviously, if everybody FOMOs into it and there's tons of hype surrounding it, the price is going to be artificially pumped. Meaning right now it's back down to $140. But the cool thing is that Solana is more than just Solana. And if you focus on the NFT side of this, or at least the use case for that, the two major upsides I see on this compared to like OpenSea is first of all, the transaction is so much faster. They even say in the description because of the incredibly short processing times. And then also they're like close to no gas fees. I think it's like 50 cent or so on gas fees. The point is compared to like Ethereum, it's like a hundred times cheaper. So there's that. And if you like to get into NFTs anyways, and you don't want to pay the insane fees, then maybe this is something for you. Before we take a closer look at the website though, keep in mind this is still in beta, which means it's not officially launched yet, but the site works and you can even see that up here the daily volume is almost 30,000 sol, which translates to like $4 million. When you scroll down, you can see the Degen Ape Academy, Orrery, Soulpunks. Maybe you guys like llamas. Maybe you guys like bears. Maybe kaiju cards. Maybe other things as well. If you were to buy an NFT on this site, you would just hit on explore on any of those. And then you have a pretty solid overview on how each NFT looks like. Let's say we were to buy the one in the top right. We would just click on that. It tells you who owns it can be the token and if you connect your wallet you could then easily buy it that however is just website wallet connect buy stuff right the usual there are a couple other upsides to this and for that i would like to take a look at a project called famous fox federation i talked to one of the guys and he allowed me to have like a more in-depth look into the site and how minting an NFT on Solana is going to look like for them as well as for you as the user. Also, because they're very kind, they are giving away one of the NFTs they have for you guys. And all you gotta do for that is join the Discord in the description down below, which also means you're immediately whitelisted for the actual NFT drop, which happens in five days from now. Five days and 20 hours to be precise, depending on when this video goes live. So roughly five days. What is the famous Fox Federation? Simple, 7,777. The lucky number four times are randomly generated and stylistically generated NFTs that exist on the Solana blockchain. They're also going to donate 1500 soul from the proceeds of the NFT drop. And in the future, Federation members can participate in exclusive events like NFT mints, raffles, community giveaways, and so much more. One of their upcoming steps in their roadmap is the world domination, which is definitely going to happen where breeding is going to be one of the options. When two foxes love one another very much, yeah, you know how that goes. You can then take two NFTs that you have and then crossbreed them, create a new one. In the future, you can also stake your NFT, meaning you get X amount of paid out over time just for holding the NFT. You can mint them on September 30th. The exact time is probably going to be announced in the Discord server. For that again, link down below. It's gonna be two sol each, meaning for the price right now for two sol, roughly $270, $280, depending on how the price goes up and down and when you buy soul. How will I be able to mint? You will be able to connect your wallet directly to our website. We recommend Phantom for web and Solid for mobile. I personally gonna use Phantom as well as in the showcasing in a minute, just because I found it to be the easiest one to use as somebody who hasn't really played with Solana that much. Also for the pre-sale, which I think I didn't mention, or at least I should mention it again, when you join the Discord through my link, you not just get whitelisted, but you're also going to be able to participate in the pre-sale. So feel free to check it out. But now to the minting part. The cool thing I found about Solana and I guess the Phantom wallet in my case as well, is when you connect them to a site, you have a little window that pops up that reads auto approve. Means whenever you try to mint something or make a transaction, you don't have to wait for the additional pop-up window to show up and then you have to approve that manually. Obviously, only ever do that on sites that you trust and if you would like to just spam click one of the projects when they go live, I just thought it's kind of a cool thing that they have in there. Because sometimes when I played like play-to-earn games like Crypto Blades, for example, and I had to like 
manually approve every single fight hundreds of times every single day. I would have wished there would be such a feature, which there might have been, but I didn't do the research. Just gonna be honest here. In order to participate in any pre-sale, and that is just the showcasing of Fox Federation at the moment, but that's gonna be the same thing for other Solana projects as well, is that when you click on, for example, in this case, Mint Fox, it will tell you that the sale hasn't started. That means if you aren't whitelisted yet, you can't just mint anything. If you then get whitelisted, the button will turn from a silver, grayish to a gold, which then means you can mint X amount of foxes, and here up to 10. That would happen when the pre-sale starts and you're already whitelisted. If you're not whitelisted, it's gonna look like that, where it again tells you you're not whitelisted. However, if you are whitelisted and then you click the button, there's going to be the pop-up window to let you know what you're about to mint and if you want to approve it or reject it. And there it tells you everything you need to know, and then you just gotta hit the blue approve button, and then you start to mint. If you would have auto approve enabled you don't need to approve it manually over and over but in this case i just click it over and over and over approve up to five and then you can see in the bottom left that they are being minted right now i think it took a total of 10 15 seconds maximum until the mint showed up in my wallet so it's pretty fast when it comes to that i think the last project that i personally minted on cardano on cnft took i think an hour and a half to show up in my wallet but that might also vary from project to project and how they wrote their code what i also think is pretty cool instead of using a different website to showcase the tokens that you have in your wallet the nfts that you just minted you can just click on your wallet icon in the extension and then it shows you the nfts that you own at the moment to clarify it those are only for the test those are not the real nfts which is why there's like fox federation written all over them the actual one won't be covered in words. And then if you have a wallet that did not get whitelisted and was not part of the pre-sale, but the public sale is about to start, you can then just go with that wallet and also mint your NFTs. You would then get the notifications that your NFTs are being minted and that they are successful. I just think it's cool to see, because I haven't seen that on other sites yet, that if you're whitelisted, that it looks different for you than to other users. If I'm not mistaken, the only ever project that did that on OpenSea was EtherCards. And for that, they had to kind of like hack the site or write like custom code or something like that. And in Solana, it just works. Because I'm personally getting more and more involved in the NFT space outside of OpenSea, I think I will cover like a couple projects, maybe tomorrow, maybe the day after, and on which platform you can buy them. Because when I first heard about NFTs, I thought, oh, those are the expensive ones, the ones for like 200,000. But in reality, there's so many more that are pretty much accessible to all of us. And I'm a collector by heart. I started with some PSA 10 Yu-Gi-Oh cards in first edition, which was way too much money spent on that earlier this year. And because of that, I kind of I like NFTs because when you get in early and you believe in a project and you don't just get something that you like that you can display but also something that has or contains a value most of the time and then maybe it goes up for the stonks maybe it goes down you never know so I would say guys thanks for watching maybe Solana NFTs are something for you as well the links for the famous Fox Federation and the discord link so you can join and get whitelisted for the pre-sale as well are in the description down below so make sure to check them out there's also the giveaway where if you just click the link and join you have the chance of winning one of those foxes which if it's worth two sol Hey, you get a free fox. Thanks for watching. Have a good rest of your day and take care.